today's video i'm going to show you how you can create a video mock-up using the free tool canva in just two minutes so all you have to do is open canva.com if you don't already have an account you can create a free account and then i'm actually going to create something of a square version so i'm going to select instagram story from it and you can choose from any of the given um you know layouts or you can just go for a blank one like i just did so I'm going to select a blank uh, template for Instagram post, which is a square version. And I'm actually going to include a mockup that has device photos on it, which is either on the top view or from a front view and which is laid out straight. So I'm going to go click photos and I'm going to make sure that I'm filtering only the free ones out if you're using a free account or you can also select pro if you're also in a pro version of it. So I'm going to select for something like laptop or iMac or iPad or anything that you prefer and you feel like goes along with whatever sized post you are creating. So I'm creating a square version. So I'm going to make sure that I select something that uh, fits this space and also doesn't take up too much uh, you know, space on the screen as well. So for example, I'm gonna select this version because it's right straight and I'm just gonna reposition this so it fits. So just for another example, I'm gonna add a new page and maybe I'm gonna uh, select iPad and let's see what comes up. So let's say I'm gonna click this. So I'm just going to reposition this and drag it so it fits and I'll click on it and adjust its position. So I'm all good to go. So now what I want to do is I want to make this a little more bigger. So it appears right. Okay, done. So you can choose any photographs from Canva itself or you can use any stock photographs online which is free for use in com uh, for commercial purposes now what i'm going to do is i'm going to go zoom in a little bit and i'm going to go to elements and i am going to add a grid like this so when i click on grid now what i'm going to do is resize this according to the screen and so make sure it's perfect and it fits the screen I'm also going to create another version right here. So for more accuracy, you can also use your keyboard uh, shortcuts or your arrow keys. So if it is too close and you want to adjust it. So I'm just going to stick it this way. Next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, you know, if you've recorded a video, you can upload it here. And what I am going to do is I have uploaded actually a recorded video and I am going to just drag and drop on it. And you can see it automatically starts working. So similarly here, Let's say I want to use something else. Um, let's say I want to use this. Or maybe even this, for example. Okay. Or let's say this. So since this is actually for a desktop version rather than an iPad, so I'm just going to show you an example of how so if you have like an ipad or an iphone version of the mock-up video then you can go ahead and add that here or i can add this this is one of my recorded videos for my igtv so i can readjust this to fit and i can just and it's done so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna show you how this is done so i'm gonna download only the first page if you want you can select even the second page and you can download it but i'm only selecting the first page and then i'm gonna click done as a video version and then i'm gonna hit download so it'll take some time depending upon the file size 
for it to download and once it's downloaded you'll be able to play this as a video and you can upload this on any social media platforms now another tip on choosing your uh, stock photographs is if you have something that goes along with your brand colors you can go ahead and do that so i'm just gonna click and double click this just to show you how it looks like So there it is, a square image with a video mockup. So that's how easy it is to create a video mockup using Canva in just two minutes. So all you need to have is at least a free version of Canva account, a video downloaded, depending upon the screen size that you're using, make sure to record a video accordingly and then just drag and drop on the grid. So I hope you liked it. Make sure to like and share the video. Thank you so much.